this is the story of the three little pigs, the three little pigs, the three little pigs. This is the story of the three little pigs, once upon a time. The three little pigs had three little homes, all in a row, all in a row. The three little pigs had three little homes, once upon a time. My house is made of straw. My house is made of sticks. says tortoise huggy what's a tortoise a tortoise is a very big turtle and what's a hare a hare is a kind of rabbit why don't they just call the story the turtle and the rabbit <laughs> well that's a very good question can we just read the story <laughs> all right then one day the hare was teasing her friend the tortoise and she wasn't being very nice the boastful hare could run really really fast but the kind old tortoise was very, very slow. To be so slow, it must be sad. It must be very, very bad. The tortoise, he got pretty mad the day of the big, big race. Well, let's have a race, said he. You're too slow. You can't beat me. I can. You can't. Well, let's just see. The day of the big, big race. Stuck in glue The day of the big, big race The hare, she laughed Ho, ho, ho That old tortoise is slow, slow, slow I can't be beaten No, no, no The day of the big, big race Poor old tortoise, sure enough Moved so slow and huffed and puffed He 
was tired, but he was tough the day of the big, big race. I am miles and miles ahead. I think I'll take a nap. She said in a carrot patch she made a bed the day of the big, big race. Snore the day of the big, big race. So old Tortoise trudged along, whistling a happy song. He was slow, but he was strong the day of the big, big race. I won't give up, no, no, no. His confidence began to grow. Come on, legs, let's go, go, go. The day of the big, big race. Even when the hill was steep, still he climbed and still he creeped, and still the hare was fast asleep. The day of the big, big race. Finally, he passed the hare, fast asleep and unaware. The finish line, I'm almost there. The day of the big, big Began to cheer and cheer and slowly toward us he drew near the hare awoke and said oh dear the day of the big big race the hare began to run and run oh no oh no what have I done hooray the slow old tortoise won the day of the big big race the lesson here is plain to see Whether slow or fast you be If you work hard, you will succeed The day of the big, big race The day of the big, big race Giant chased, 
Take Huggy's apple? No. Hey, my apple's gone. It wasn't me. Well, Buggy, what's that? Um. Hmm. I think it might be a good time to tell you a story, Buggy. There was a boy who watched the sheep, the silliest boy you ever did see. One sunny day, who knows why? He thought for fun he'd tell a lie. The boy cried, Wolf, please, please come! Hurry, hurry! Run, run, run! And up the hill, a farmer came to chase that wolf away again. There was no wolf, not even one. It's just a trick! I played for fun! The farmer said, See here, young man, don't play that trick on me again. Okay! The very next day, 
at half past ten, the silly boy cried wolf, wolf again. And up the hill the farmer came to chase that wolf away again. There was no wolf, not even one. It's just a trick. I played for fun. The farmer said, See here, young man, don't play that trick on me again. Okay, I promise. But that same day, at quarter past two, a big bad wolf came into view. Into the field, the wolf did creep, to scare the boy and steal the sheep. The boy cried, Wolf, please, please come, hurry, hurry, run, run, run. Wolf, wolf, it's not a game, please come now. But no one came. The silly boy, he shook with fright That wolf stole every sheep in sight The little boy was very sad Because he knew that he'd been bad He decided there and then I'll never ever lie again The most important thing to do Is always, always tell, tell the, the truth, truth. <laughs> Okay, you two, snuggle in and close your eyes, and I'll read you the story of Little Red Riding Hood. Yay! Little Red Riding Hood went out one day. Uh-huh, uh-huh. She was going to Granny's far away. Uh-huh, uh-huh. She fought a path through the deep dark woods to get to Granny's as quick as she could. Uh-huh. Big bad wolf came into view. Uh huh, uh huh. He raised his hat and said, How do you do? Uh huh, uh huh. She said, My granny is feeling ill. I'm bringing her cookies to make her well. Uh huh, uh huh, uh She walked away, but the big bad wolf knew a faster way. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. The big bad wolf came to Granny's house. Uh huh, uh huh. And poor old Granny was all alone. Uh huh, uh huh. Granny, get in the cupboard. That bad wolf said, then he put on her clothes and jumped into bed. Uh huh. Here, come over here. But the little girl knew something was weird. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Granny, what great big ears you have. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Granny, what great big eyes you have. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Granny, what great big teeth you have. The wolf said, Better to eat you with. And the big bad wolf, he never came back. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. We're safe now, Granny. The little girl said. Uh huh, uh huh. And she helped Granny get back in bed. Uh huh, uh huh. They ate the cookies happily, and that's the end of our story. Uh -huh. Once there lived
lived three grizzly bears in a house in the forest. Papa bear, mama bear, baby bear sat down to eat their porridge. Ooh, much too hot. Growled Papa bear, let's go walk in the forest. That's when Goldilocks came by, found their house in the thicket. Knock, 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 no answer, so Goldie entered the kitchen. Mmm, smells good. She grabbed a spoon, though she had no permission. Papa Bear's porridge, way too hot. Mama Bear's porridge, way too cold. Baby Bear's porridge, just right, just right, just right. After Goldie had her fill, she felt lazy and tired. In the living room, she spied chairs of three different sizes. They looked quite inviting, so Goldie thought she'd try them. Papa Bear's chair, way too hard. Mama Bear's chair, way too soft. Baby Bear's chair, just right. Just right, just right. Just as gold he settled in that chair, broke into pieces. Gold he went upstairs and found three nice beds she could sleep in. They looked quite inviting, so Papa's bed she creeped in. Papa Bear's bed, way too hard. Mama Bear's bed, way too soft. Baby Bear's bed, just right, just right, just right. Goldilocks fell fast asleep. Three bears came back home. Soon as they stepped in, they knew they were not alone. <sighs> Someone's been eating my porridge. Growled Papa. Someone's been eating my porridge. They said Mama. Someone's been eating my porridge. I cried Baby. And they ate it all up. Ate it all up. They walked into the living room, and what do you think they noticed? <laughs> Someone's been sitting in my chair. Growled Papa. Someone's been sitting in my chair. They said Mama. Someone's been sitting in my chair. I cried Baby. And they broken it up. Broken it up. Upstairs in their bedroom now, what do you think they noticed? <sighs> Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Growled Papa. Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Said Mama. Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Cried Baby. And there she is, there she is. Goldilocks woke up and saw three brown bears staring at her. She screamed, Help! Jumped out of bed and ran away with the clatter Down the stairs and through the door Goldie's gone forevermore Our three bears, they scratched their heads Fixed the chair and made the beds And sat down to eat their porridge And that is the story of the three bears Yeah! And Billy the Biggie. The Billy Goat's Gruff. Billy the Biggie, the Billy Goat's Gruff. They ate and ate the grass all day until it all was gone. They ate all the clover till none was left over. They were lawn mowers, those Billy Goat's Gruff. They were lawn mowers, those Billy Goat's Gruff. But over a river and over a bridge was a hillside covered with grass. Green and delicious And rich and nutritious It answered their wishes, that yummy fresh grass It answered their wishes, that yummy fresh grass Billy the Little ran down to the river And onto the bridge he hopped Clippity cloppity, hippity hoppity Up jumped a troll and he hollered out Stop! Up jumped a troll and he hollered and stop Who are you? Said the troll I'm Billy the Little Goat Graf 
Before I get thinner, I'll eat you for dinner. Would this be the end for this Billy Goat Gruff? Would this be the end for this Billy Goat Gruff? Oh, please, Mr. Troll. I'm very small, and you look very hungry. Billy the Middle Goat Gruff is coming next, and he's much bigger and tastier than I am. Well, all right, then. Be off with you. I'll wait for Billy the Middle Goat Gruff. Billy the Middle ran down to the river and onto the bridge he hopped. Clippity cloppity hippity hoppity up jumped the troll and he hollered out Stop! Up jumped the troll and he hollered and stop. Who are you? Said the troll. I'm Billy the Middle Goat Gruff. Before I get thinner, I'll eat you for dinner. Would this be the end for this Billy Goat Gruff? Would this be the end for this Billy Goat Gruff? Oh, please, Mr. Troll, I'm not very big, and you look very hungry. Billy the Biggie Goat Gruff is coming next, and he's much bigger and tastier than I am. Well, all right, then. Be off with you. I'll wait for Billy the Biggie Goat Gruff. Billy the Biggie ran down to the river and onto the bridge he hopped. Clippity cloppity hippity hoppity up jumped the troll and he hollered out. Stop! Up jumped the troll and he hollered and stop. Who are you? Said the troll. I'm Billy the Biggie Goat Gruff. Before I get thinner, I'll eat you for dinner. Would this be the end for this Billy Goat Gruff? Oh, yeah? Billy the Biggie, he lowered his horns and charged straight at the troll. And end over end over hill over glen and over the mountain that bad troll flew. Over the mountain that bad troll flew. And happily ever after lived upon that grassy bluff. Billy the Little and Billy the Middle and Billy the Biggie. The Billy Goat's Gruff And Billy the Biggie the Billy Goat's Gruff Let's go to the Dinosaur Zoo! Woo! Alright! Let's go meet a dinosaur Dinosaur, dinosaur Let's go meet a dinosaur At the Big Jurassic Zoo And watch that Rex 
Are you ready for the animal dance? Come on! The animal dance, the animal dance Do a little boogie, a little boogie Watch Mr. Lion clap his hands Doing the animal dance Listen, we all have those days when things go wrong. Sure, the most important thing to remember is to always do your best and don't give up. You'll see. It might take a while, but you'll get it right. Just remember the story of the itsy bitsy spider.
Baby Shark. Baby Shark. Baby Shark. Baby Shark. Baby Shark, Baby Shark from the sea. Baby Shark, Baby Shark, come to me. Baby Shark, Baby Shark, swimming around. Baby Shark, Baby Shark, don't slow down. Baby Shark, Baby Shark, the dooby dooby doo. Kids, you're swimmers now. Swimming, swimming in the swimming pool. Congratulations, you look very cool. Thanks, this is so much fun. Am I doing this part right? Very well, yes. <laughs> Let's see how far we can go. All around the pool. This is Swimming, swimming in the swimming pool. Congratulations, you look very 
Congratulations, you look very cool. I'm so glad we learned how to swim today. Yeah, swimming is amazing. <laughs> Saves a kitty on the big red fire truck. Huggy saves a kitty on the big red fire truck. Here come the Super Supremes! Transportation, huh? I think I know a song. Really? Would you like to hear it? Of course. Submarine. See the fishes swimming in the sea of green. 
or blast off way up through the galaxy in a rocket ship from Kennedy.
Natasha. Puggy, puggy, huggy, puggy, where are you? Here we are, here we are, achoo! Sure. And gummies? Okay. And nuts? 
yeah. And chocolate chips. Uh -oh. And top it off with marshmallow dip. Here you go. Don't let it slip. <laughs> Do you know the ice cream man? The ice cream man? The ice cream man. One foot, two feet, one 